Yo, what's up, Tarnish? It's your boy Albie, and we back with another video, bro. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about the clans for AOT Revolution. We're gonna rank, you know, only epics and legendaries, anything under, you know, <laughs> we really don't really, you know, tear list because nobody really cares about anything that's under. You just wanna be the best. So, we're gonna keep it nice and short. And we're gonna first walk through, you know, that's the epic clans and, like, what's, you know, what to expect. So, so first and foremost, Zoe. I think or Zoe, whatever, however you pronounce her name. So her ability. With her ability, you cannot Titan Shift. You get 10% um, ODM gear control, 10% ODM gear speed, and five upgrade costs. Five percent, uh, negative five percent upgrade costs. So you know you save a little bit of money. Bonus skill, last stand. Last stand gives you 15 ODM um, damage. It gives you I said ODM damage. 15% um, damage, ODM speed, OD, um. And then damage reduction. You get 30% damage reduction? That's nuts. <whistles> hey, bro. It's still trash, though. I ain't gonna lie to you. Respectfully. I am. I'm not gonna be sure. I'm not gonna be sure. You, you're saying calm. And now we got the, the Warhammer Titan, which is Tyra Burr, whatever you, however you want to pronounce that. Um, Titan shifting. Uh, Titan shifting duration by 10%. Useless, because there's, there's, there's not like a. You can stay in the form, so. It's, literally useless i guess it was thinking about making it like oh you can stay in your titan form for a certain amount of time but yeah no bad and then you gain 10 percent warhammer titan stats when they do add that so right now it's not that useful you gain 10 percent um gold you have you get more gold you have shift shifters regen uh, i think damn near all these clans have it all these titan clans have it so where do I put it on this list? I honestly think it's below. I'm not gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it stacked with you. There's there's a lot that's you feel me, Leon Hart. Um Leon Hart is Annie's clan, the female Titan. You get 10% Titan run. Uh, um run speed, which is great. You already know how fast the Titans are, you know, on just like the base stats. You gain 10% female Titan stats. I can't wait to see that Titan. Um gain 10% damage. And you get the shifters regen. I also think it's alright. I think it's above her though, respectfully. And now we on to the next one. Gillard, Gallard, however you want to pronounce the name. Um, to become a Titan shifter. Okay, so you, you could become a Titan. You can become a Titan shifter. You get 10% Titan attack speed. Why is that together? Attack speed. I guess you punch faster. You gain 10% jaw titan stats, which I would love to see, by the way. I, I want to see how they make that. 10% um, critical damage, and then titan um, shift to regen. Attack speed. Uh, 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 like, the, like the attack speed is not is nothing crazy, but if you time it right, bro, you should be able to. You should be able to just like you know what I'm saying, cut it out. So, and then after after this, you get the finger, which is um, I think that's how you say it, the finger. That's her clan's name, which is the um, cart titan. You get five five percent um, titan shifting duration. You gain ten percent cart titan stats. You get ten percent ODM gas, which I, I mean I don't really. The gas be running out for me, I'm not gonna cap, but it's nothing too major. Then you get family um shift the region. Oh my god, I'm I'm saying that wrong. My my bad chat it is shift the region. Family skill. There we go. Like the duration, it makes no sense to me because like bro, it's there's no duration and it's less than the the Warhammer. And then Ryan, Ryan, which is the Warhammer Titan, you get you, ooh, 10%, uh, negative 10% damage taken from Titan, gain 10% armor Titan stats, gain a 10% a ten maximum health. Now, this guy is not bad at all. And you get Titan regen. Not bad at all. I'll put him up here for sure. Or was it? Oh, okay. This is um, Armin's clan. Armin clan, you get 10% Colossal Titan. Stats, Colossal Titan, AOE, 
plus 20%, which I'm assuming your explosion when that ever does come out. But as for right now, and you get 10% uh, crit chance. Ship to regen. Honestly, I'm about to put you down here, buddy. You're not that great. No, come back next year. Um, 10, 10, you get 10, 10 plus Titan damage. You get 10 plus Titan damage. You gain uh, 10 plus Beast Titan stats. You gain 10% ODM range. You get family, family skills, ship to regen. Okay. Ability button, regenerate 50 health and all injuries over blah 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 okay that's just what chapter re uh, um, chip the regen does hmm 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 I don't know how to feel about this but I'll put it up here I'll put it up here now we're talking about these three demons these these three demons Reese respectfully you're a, you're a A bro you're alright you're alright you're nothing crazy you're nothing crazy cause they made you the seven like bro if they didn't make if they, you know, if they didn't make Reese, I'm gonna read y'all its stats. But if they didn't make so that you know Reese can like, um, Reese has to be at 75%. I would have put Reese at S tier, but that was like the only thing that was good with Reese personally. Um, then, then you know you have Jaeger coming back to life, then Ackerman having that one skill that gives like automatically lethal hits that like one shot Titans. You know Reese is just not sitting up there for real, for me. Like the family, with the family though, you gain um, 10 Titan stats, 10% Titan stats, plus 10 XP boost, and negative, huh? Okay, 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 upgrade cost. So you get 10% upgrade cost uh, lower. So that's great, you save some money. I didn't even know that. Gain 5% um, XP for all party members. Ooh, I didn't know that either. Apparently when you're farm with me. And the more Reese's we have in the party, the more levels you can get. Wow, I gotta try that out. Gain extra support perk slot. Yeah, I know that. And then the conquer the ability. The um, the conquer what it does is basically it stops everything. It stops everything temporarily, not for a very long time. It stops literally everything in the area. You probably kill like a maximum of like four titans if you're that good. But yeah, let's move on to the next one. All right, Ackerman. Ackerman, you cannot become a titan. You gain twenty percent damage. Um. <laughs> Yo, Ackerman has mad buffs. 15% 15, 15 critical chance, 15% crit damage. You gain 10% ODM gas, 10% um, ODM range, 10% ODM control. You gain double jump, plus one boost dash. Um, gain an extra offensive perk slot. Bonus feature rage mode. Like, bro. And then, you know you know the, the other three skills that they come with which is you know the rage mode then you have you know that spiral thing that he does and then the the swift strikes which is you know automatically 10 um five titan kills which is phenomenal now what does jaeger say is jaeger better is jaeger better than ackerman now we're gonna find out here if jaeger is better than ackerman now what how many y'all think jaeger is better than ackerman i'm about to let y'all know my opinion right now so we're gonna look at Jaeger's stats real quick. Jaeger gets negative 10% Titan shifting cooldown, which is okay because we don't even have a cooldown for it anymore since we can only transform one. So that's that's out of the window. Gains 10% um, attack Titan stats, and I'm not gonna lie, since the attack Titan is out right now, Jaeger literally is sitting a little bit above because especially with the rage mode, you have to be Jaeger to use the rage mode. So do you gain 15% um, critical chance? You gain extra defense perk slot. I'm not gonna lie, Jaeger doesn't have much. And then you get you get you get these perks. You can heal yourself, right? You get the rage mode, and you get another. You get two abilities that heal you, and one of them literally heals like chronic injuries and stuff like that, like bad injuries on your body. So that's pretty fire. And then if you die, you can come back to life. Like Jaeger's like bro. It's, it's hard to die as a Jaeger. That's, what, that's all I'm hearing right now. So, personally, bro, Jaeger's, Jaeger's a little broken right now. I'm not going to cap. Especially if you have Titan shifting, bro. You would have died, came back to life with another Titan shifting. So, you basically shift twice. But, yeah, bro, let me know how y'all feel about this tier list, bro. If y'all would have done it different. This is my tier list. Yep. Make sure y'all leave a like, comment, subscribe, bro. Join the family. And, you know, let me know what y'all think, bro. Catch y'all on the next one.
because I 